Welcome to the MyTopo website and we have some exciting new website features to show you. So if you go to our home page and click on the white button here where it says click here to see all maps available in your area, you can search for a location to start with. So you can type in an address or a town or a natural feature. So I'm just going to type in the name of a town here. And as you type it in, you'll see the results come up. So I'll click on Bozeman, Montana. And you'll see after I click on it that the map frame is going to come up here. And within the map view, you can scroll around, you can zoom in and out. But what you're really wanting to do here is just find the center point of your map. So the zoom level doesn't really matter. What really matters here is that you have the map centered up approximately where you want it. Okay, now on the right side, you'll see some of our stock existing map options. If you scroll down to the bottom, you'll see the option that says custom map. Go ahead and click on that. And this will give you all the custom map options. So to start with, you can put in a title and you can put in the owner's name if you would like, or just leave it blank. The map types, so you can select the topo map, the enhanced relief shading, um, or an aerial photo. Scale one to 24,000 is most common, but you can modify that if you want. So click on the next button here. And this is the grid options, latitude, longitude, UTM. I'll go ahead and do uh, tick marks with UTM and the same for latitude, longitude. And finally, we'll go with our paper size and format. You can do uh, portrait or landscape and different map sizes. I'll go up to 24 by 36 inches and change it to folded and click on the preview button. And this will take just a minute, but this will show you what your map is actually going to look like. Now, once the preview comes up, it's there, it shows you a small map image. Go ahead and click on that to enlarge it, and you'll be able to see the detail to get an idea of what your map looks like. And click again to make it smaller. And if the map looks good to you, you can go ahead and proceed here. If it does not look good or you need to change something, just click on Revise Map and you can change some of those options. All right, so what you want to do here is put in your name, email, and phone number to proceed with the purchase. And if you want to set up a, a session to talk with a map maker, you can click on Consult with Map Maker. In most cases though, as long as the preview looks good, you can just go ahead and click on Purchase Map. And this will take you to the uh, shopping cart and allow you to add the map to your shopping cart and go through the checkout process. All right, it shows you an example map here. It does not look exactly like your map. That's okay, just go ahead and click on Add to Cart. And at this point, you can go ahead and check out. If you would like to add additional maps, you can go back to the home page and start and search again. So just keep doing this until you have what you want in your shopping cart and then go through the checkout process. So keep an eye on our website. There will be more changes to come, but we're excited to offer you this opportunity to set up and order a custom topo map all on our website.